Hello everyone. Welcome to another episode of To the Point. Today's topic of discussion is India's semiconductor revolution. First of all, let's see why it is in the news. India's semiconductor market is rapidly expanding and is projected to reach 100 to 110 billion US dollar by 2030 driven by the global push for digitalization and automation. With significant investments and strategic initiatives such as the India Semiconductor Mission ISM, India aims to establish itself as a self-reliant semiconductor hub by 2030. Now let's discuss about India's semiconductor industry. India is making remarkable strides in the semiconductor industry, which is integral to various sectors including healthcare, transportation, communication, defense, and space technology. Semiconductors, particularly in the form of chips, are at the core of devices that enable modern life. From smartphones to satellites, a semiconductor chip, acting like the brain of these devices, processes information and ensures their smooth functioning. India has begun to address the global dependence on semiconductor manufacturing, especially following the disruptions caused by the COVID-19 pandemic and geopolitical tensions, like the Russia-Ukraine war. By initiating projects under the Make in India campaign and the India Semiconductor Mission, India is building a strong foundation for becoming a crucial supplier of semiconductors. Now let's talk about India Semiconductor Mission. The India Semiconductor Mission, ISM, approved in December 2021, is aimed at setting up chip manufacturing plants, fabs, packaging and testing units, and supporting chip design startups. This mission is backed by a significant 76,000 crore rupees investment, marking a major step in reducing the nation's reliance on imported chips. ISM's focus is to create an ecosystem for sustainable semiconductor and display manufacturing. Key objectives include setting up chip manufacturing facilities, supporting startups, promoting research and development, and facilitating international collaborations. The initiative also encourages the transfer of advanced technologies and aims to make India a global hub for semiconductor manufacturing. Under the ISM, several schemes such as the Design Linked Incentive Scheme, Semiconductor Fab Scheme, and Compound Semiconductors and ATM POSAT Scheme have been launched to bolster India's semiconductor production and design capabilities. Now, lastly, moving on to India's role in the global semiconductor market. India's market size for semiconductors is rapidly growing. By 2025, it is expected to reach 45 to 50 billion US dollar, with projections pointing towards 100 to 110 billion US dollar by 2030. The country is focusing on the three main pillars of the semiconductor supply chain, equipment, materials and services. India's rich resources of chemicals, minerals and gases, combined with a strong talent pool in AI, big data, cloud computing and IoT, place it in a strategic position to support the global semiconductor ecosystem. Now is the time for practice question. Consider the following statements about India's semiconductor mission. One. The mission has an outlay of 40,000 crore rupees for strengthening India's semiconductor ecosystem. 2. The India Semiconductor Mission was approved by the Union Cabinet in December 2024. Which of the statements given above is or are correct? A. One only. B. Two only. C. Both one and two D. Neither one nor two. Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe 
and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.